What's happening? Rise Up 44 here on Nalio Gaming. In this video, we're going to be checking out Word Search on the PlayStation 4. Let's jump right in. Select category. Let's just go from the top. We have the zoo. Antelope. My whole thing with uh, word searches has always been to look for a part of the word that is not... It, it's looking for something that sticks out, like right there. Antelope, so I look for L-O-P-E. Elephant, I'll look for P-H-A-N-T. I don't know. It's just my way of doing it. Everybody's got their own strategy. Some people go line by line, starting at the top or the left and going all the way see if we can um, turn down this music. Okay, you can shut the background music off. So let's just go ahead and lower it right here. All right, that should be a little better. This is the pause screen. Resume. All right, get it? Pause. Ha! That's pretty good. I like it. All right, I found hippopotamus, so we're gonna go out of order. I like doing word searches, always did. It was uh, it was fun busy work in school. Like uh, if we had a substitute teacher or something and they wanted us to behave and keep quiet, of course they would give us a word search. And a couple of years back, I started working at a special needs school uh, for kids that had all sorts of special needs from you know kindergarten, first grade, all the way up to high school, 12th graders. Uh, it was a pretty crazy environment um not crazy as like kids hanging on the sh you know hanging on the ceiling fans or anything like that it was just like a crazy mix of crazy things that could happen at any moment panda right here um so i started off as a behaviorist kind of dealing with the kids that were going through the hardest times i ended up uh sub substitute teaching at the very end and what I felt was that doing word searches and things that had actual interesting content was so much, so much better. So you do a word search with all SpongeBob characters and names and words, or for certain younger kids or Minecraft, never. You just gotta kinda keep it within reason. Can't expect kids to, uh, high schoolers aren't gonna wanna do, uh, Zoo animals, for example. I mean, some might, but... And they have no problem doing one or two with zoo animals, but then it gets old quick. I'm struggling with elephant, to be honest. Found it. As I said that. There it is. All right, let's find the butterfly. Found it real quick. Looked for the FLY and there it was. All right, small words can be a pain in the butt, like emu, E-M-U, because there's gonna be a ton of E-Ms. It 
it is. Flamingo. Where are you at, Flamingo? So, I hear this does have two trophy lists. One on the PS4 and one on the PS Vita, as far as I... I think that's what I read earlier. And I can imagine there's probably a PS3... I, I don't know. Don't, don't quote me on the PS3 version. I actually don't know that. Uh, but I know there is a PS4 version and a Vita version. So, you can get two... You can get double trophies. Stack the trophies. If you are a trophy hunter. I mean, these are the type of games you can play while you're, you know, doing something else. Flamingo. F-L... F L. All right, let's look for Mingo. M I N G O. There it is. It's that easy. Flamingo. Giraffe. We're gonna look for F F E. See a lot of E E E's. All right, where are you at, F F E? You're probably watching this right now, saying it's right there. It's right there. F F E. Nope. F F. F F. Where are you? There you are. Giraffe. I knew it was over here. There was too many Fs in that corner for it not to be down there. Hedgehog. Let's look for hog. Or hedge. Hedge is probably going to be the easier word to find. It's those diagonal ones that always get you. They're backward, backward and diagonal. Those are tough. Uh, let's see, Warthog. Right? It's at the bottom. is probably up here somewhere because there's a lot of G's. There it is. It was not up there. It's on the left. Alright, kangaroo. So let's look for Roo. R-O-O. -O. For two O's next to each other. That's what we want. I want to talk to Samson. Meerkat to E's. Alright, we got a couple E's. M E E R K A T. Otter. We need O T T E R. T T. It's already used over here. T. T T. T T. T T. T T. Otter. Right here. O T T E R. Alright, penguin. Let's look for G U I N. Found it. P E N G U I N. All right. Let's look for a uh, a possum. A possum. P O S S U M. S S U M. There it is. P O S S U M. Reindeer. Grandma ran over the reindeer. Wait, is that how the? Wait, is that how that goes? <laughs> grandma, <laughs> not grandma ran over. Grandma got ran over by the reindeer. <laughs> you go, grandma ran over the reindeer. R e 
Oh, they try to trick us. See, they're trying to trick us here. R E E D. All right. So, I'm assuming it's around here somewhere. R. Hmm. R. Are you going to the mall later? Happy Gilmore? Anyone? Ranger. R E I N. R. E. R E. E R E R E R R R R R E S P C T R R R R E P R R R R. All right, I missed it. We're we're going line by line at this point. That's my last resort. And then something else I like to do is come back to it. So reptile. So let's go. That's R E two. All right. Let's leave. Let's leave the two R E's for later. Let's go taper and tiger. T a p e a, to pay. T-I-P T-I-P T-A-P T-A-P Taper T-A T-A T Reptile R-E-P-T-I-L-E And then Taper Zebra There's not a whole lot of Z's in these Is there Z Z Z Z top Zebra on the right. T A P I R T A P I R. stuff T A T I T I G E R T I T I G E R there's tiger okay we need reindeer and tape these two T I G nope T I had it there. Got excited. Taper. Reindeer is the last one. R E I N is what we need. R E I N or D E E. So, so we need two E's for deer. We got the two E's here. We got two E's here. We got two E's here. All right, let's see. Where else do we have two E's together? 1E, 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 2Es, but that doesn't help us, and same, 
two more. Two more. That doesn't help us either. E-E, that doesn't help us. R-E-I-N-D-E-E-R. There it is. So that whole time, that it was right there, right in front of me, and I just wasn't seeing it. We're just getting started. Bear with me. But um bum Pup and running. Get it. Up and running. Get it. Get it. Get it. Oh, this game. This game's got jokes for days. Alright, what do we got next? Okay. Holy cow. Alright, you know what? Let's do this. Menu. Okay, select puzzle. Time to eat, bedtime story, getting around, names, natural world, around the world, science experiment. I'm just gonna close my eyes and I'm just gonna hit all sorts of buttons. I have no idea where I am. I wish you could do random. Like I really do wish you could do random. All right, I have no idea where I am. And stop. All right, we have colors yeah colors red is my favorite color so we're going with red okay amaranth I see maroon this is gonna be a hard one a u b u r n auburn I see Cardinal. Heck yeah. Crimson? It's crimson one? Yep. The scarlet one? Amar- Yay! Look at that! A-M-A-R-A-N-T-H It's burgundy, burgundy. I see burgundy somewhere. B U. R G U N D Y. There it was. I knew I saw it. I was seeing it backward. Whatever that word is. Carmine. Oh, this is V E R Vermilion. Russet? Yep, that's one. R U S S E T. I'm seeing a lot of words without even looking on the right. I'm just like seeing the actual words. Mahogany? Yep. G A N Y. All right. R U B Y. R U. See R U S R U B Y. There it is. Rust. Raspberry.
magenta. Lava. L-A-V-E. L-A-V-A. Carmine. Last word, fuchsia. F U C H S I A. There it is. Roll out the red carpet. Congratulations. Red shades. Solved in 4 minutes 52 seconds. That's where I'm going to end my first gameplay. I appreciate you watching on Nelio Gaming. If you haven't already done so, please click that like button. Let me know in the comment section what you think. Share with your friends. Follow me on Twitter at RidesUp44 and at Nelio Gaming. And please consider subscribing to me here on Nelio Gaming. I was provided with a game key to check out Word Search. So I just want to let you guys know that. But uh, overall, I enjoyed it. I think that I will definitely jump back in and play more. I like games like this. When I come home, I like to just pop it on and play a few levels and just kind of unwind you you're using your brain power and your thinking to get the different letters to form the words but it's not like it's not too much thinking it's not it's not like you're overexerting yourself or really having to put tons of thought into solving some major puzzle it's just chill it's it's laid back find the words it's it's a word search i mean it doesn't get any any simpler than describing that a word search is a word search anyway i'd love to hear you guys thoughts down in the comment section that's going to do it for this video i'll see you in the next one